Ja. for the operator for the water bar. Okay. Now I'm going to make sure that we're pinned in. <laughs>
everyone, Tim Martino here. Happy today to be here with Team Ameripatcher to display our latest and greatest version of the Ameripatcher portable asphalt recycler. We've got some new add-ons. We've got a camera system which can be seen from inside the cab with an LCD screen. Uh, new burner style, new junction box here which is either operated with switches on the box or with the key fob. So we can turn our burner on and off, our vibrator, and our water pump as well. There's a nice indicator here to show the operator that the water is pumping. When that light's on, you're pumping water. We've got our seven gallon fuel tank on this side of the machine. A big nine inch roller on the bottom to roll potholes once you fill them with your newly recycled asphalt. A great scoop feature on the front of it so you can drive into the piles. No more having a guy standing around with a shovel loading the Ameripatcher. We can just drive in, scoop it up, hit our vibrator and spin the drum and all the material loads right into it, no problem. We've got our camera here, very good LCD screen, multiple positions so you can look inside the drum, you can look down at the scoop and see the pile that you're driving into, whether it be on the ground or in the back of a dump truck. Seven gallon water tank hooked up to a 100 PSI electric water pump with a 12 volt supply. New hydraulic manifold design so that the lines stay out of the way and protected and we have our power cord coming in, our hydraulic lines, and our camera line coming right into here. Everything's very easily accessible. It's very good for a one-man recycling operation. As you can see here, we're almost done with a batch. We're at about 250 degrees, and these are very wet millings. We're in upstate New York. Currently, our pile's at about 35 degrees Fahrenheit, and we put it into the recycler about 10 minutes ago, and we're running, uh, we had it running for about 10 minutes, so we're at about 275. Today, we're using 3 8 minus material uh, with an AC content of 5%. Uh, our pile has been sitting in the weather for quite some time. We're in upstate New York. Currently, the ambient temperature is about 36 degrees, and this pile has been moved several times. It's had rain and snow and ice, frozen and unfrozen. So the moisture content is very high. Once we burn the moisture off and the material reaches 212 degrees, it takes very little time for the asphalt to come up to the 300 degree temperature that we're looking for. So we've been running for about 10 minutes now and I'll shut the burner off and we're rolling very slow. That's the key is low and slow. You don't want to really whip it around. You roll it nice and slow, let it topple over itself and we're at 320. We're at a perfect batch temperature right now. We've been running for about 10 minutes. So we're going to go ahead and dump this out and see what the uh, asphalt looks like. And we can uh, fill in into a little spot and roll it over with the roller. I think that looks great. It's a great looking mix. Perfect size. Yeah, huh? Yeah, all the way back there is 320. Up in the front, we've got 320. 324 to the back. Great. Perfect. <laughs> okay, so we're going to empty out some of the mix onto the uh, loading platform, the scoop there. Give you an idea of what it looks like before we dump it all out, get a temperature of it. And I'll be able to see how much comes out on the scoop because of the camera in the screen on the inside. So I'm slowly just going to curl down. I'll give it a little vibrate. And we got some material coming out. Now I'm looking right through the camera. I can see that coming out of the drum and building up on the lip. And I'll curl up a little bit just to stop the rest of it from coming out. Now we should have some really good looking mix. Wow, that looks great. And as I said, we are in upstate New York, so it's a frigid day. It's about 30 degrees out. So just outside, when it came out, it went down to 290 real quick. But still inside the drum, we're at 307. Go to the back, 309, 312. Very even heating all the way through. And this mix is great. Alright, so I'm going to just dump this pile right here and see what we're looking at. Right onto this little patch of asphalt we've got in our lot. I can see with the camera the front end of the scoop. 
so I know exactly how much material is coming out and when it starts coming out. And I'm just going to dump it. All right, just like filling a pothole. Turn my water bar on. Okay, we're spraying water and we're just going to roll this stuff out. Turn the water off. That's what a patch will look like. Very simple, folks. Easy to use. Good mix, man. Wow. Super pliable. You'd be able to rake this with a loot real quick. <laughs> Ooh,